Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. I've been following what is happening uh, in the Alliance. Before we talk, I want to ask uh, Chishim Bakamburi some questions. I know that he's watching this broadcast right now. I want to ask him a question before we proceed. In the first place, the battle is not about, uh, 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 it's not a personal battle. The battle that we all have entered into in Zambia is a battle to liberate the people of Zambia. It's not a battle to enrich ourselves. We don't talk about riches. If you are talking about riches, we, we have it. And we are not selfish about it. We cannot continue being rich and rich and rich and rich. At the end of the day, where is he going to take us? The battle that we are having in Zambia today is a battle of selflessness. It's a battle of people that, that want to lay down their life. Even the Bible said it. There is no greater love than this, that a man lay down his life for the sake of his friends. It's a battle to liberate the people of Zambia. And uh, Honorable Chishimba Kamburi is aware of this. He knows that it's a battle to liberate the people of Zambia. And uh, what I am seeing now, what I'm hearing now, is no longer what is, what is supposed to be done. I said I'm going to address Akainde Chilemande Chishimbakamburi, but let me start with Honorable Chishimbakamburi. I can see that there is a lot of things that are not adding up in the life of Chishimbakamburi and whatever that is happening. I'm not uh, accusing him. I respect him a lot, like I respect any other person. But I want him to answer these few questions and clear the people of Zambia. There are, there are, there are over 8,000 people that are watching now. He's going to hit 10,000 any moment from now. A lot of people are watching from Zambia. I want to ask Chishimba a question that he, I would love him to give me the answer. I know PF. PF arrested Chishimba Kamburi because he forged a signature within his family, family business. He forged a signature, signature of his son, and he was arrested and he was convicted for such a small case. Is it possible, Chishimba Kamburi, that uh, there is a case that is going on where over 160,000 US dollars was stolen from your house. From your house. And PF, they have heard about it. The police have heard about it. Kangaja have heard about it. And you have not been arrested for money laundering. Is it possible if you are not very close to PF? I'm not saying that you are close to PF. I don't want to call you Judas. I don't want to talk about you. If I talk about you, table will shake. I don't want to talk about you. I'm asking you a question. Is it possible that you are not, you cannot be arrested for having such an amount in your house if you are not close to PF? I want you to stand up and tell the people of Zambia the truth. Are you eating with the PF and eating with the people of Zambia? Or are you with the people of Zambia against PF? Truly speaking, if you are with the people of Zambia, by now they have, they have arrested you. They arrested you for no case. Why are they not arresting you for having over 160,000 US dollars in your house? 
I'm told your daughter stole the money from your house and the others. 160,000. In according to the law of Zambia, because I've been there, I studied the law. It's money laundering. Why are they not arresting you for money laundering? You must answer these questions. Let me tell you, people of Zambia. I am CIA one. I am ahead of time. I have already, when we are in 2020, I came to 2021 and told you that Chishimba Kambur is going to be arrested. And the reason why they want to arrest him is because they don't want him to stand as a president and they don't want him, they don't want Chishimba Kambur, they don't want him to stand as a running mate. They are going to arrest him and they are going to convict him. I told the people of Zambia openly. Exactly do I told you. Didn't it happen? It happened. The question I'm asking this night is that Chishimba Kambuiri, did you remember how Dora Silia insulted you in PF? <laughs> Did you remember how after you campaign, you single-handedly campaigned for Eddie Galungu in 2016? Did you remember how he kicked you out from the party? He treated you like a piece of shit. He treated you like a used tissue. He pushed you away. Did you, did you still remember that? Tishim Bakamburi, if you are not aware, I know that you were in prison by then. PF government with their police stripped your wife and your daughter naked at the court are these the people that you want to go back and start eating with <laughs> in nigeria there is a parable that says if you have been beaten by a bee before when you hear the sound of fly you run away <laughs> because you don't want to be beaten twice there is nothing good about pf government pf government is a rotten government it's a useless government. It's a satanic government. Are these the people that you want to go back and start eating with? I am asking you a question, Tishim Bakamburi. I don't want to talk about you. I don't want to go deeper. I just want you to answer these questions. Eddie Galungu used you like a chala boy and threw you away like a fool. Is it the person you want to go and start eating with again, Tishim Bakamburi? This is the question that I'm asking you. Somebody say, Papa. The, the video is shaking. I'm sorry because I'm holding it in my hand. I like holding video, holding it in my hand so that you know that it's real. Tishim Bakambu, what do you want to do with PF? Let me assure you that I already knew ahead of time that you are going to be brought down. You are going to be shaken. And compromised by the PF and the, I I have always encouraged you not to shake there is nothing good about PF PF has already lost the election I am coming to talk about this I'm going to give you proof if you are watching me right now anywhere you are watching me from you are watching me right now I don't know where you are watching me from maybe you are watching me from Zambia you are watching me from from Nigeria from Cameroon from I don't know where you are watching me from Everything that I said about Zambia and Zambia election, all of them, tell me which of them that did not happen. I told you in the first place that the way Edgar Lungu and PF is planning to rig the election, I was already in the system. Before I came out from Zambia, before I was deported from Zambia, I was already in the system. I was there. I know everything about the system. Plus the help of Godfather, there is nothing hidden. Everything I told you, I told you that they are going to register a lot of people in their stronghold. They are going to give opposition stronghold manufactured machine they are going to give a lot of excuses so that they will register a lot of people in their stronghold thinking that they have won the election registering one million people from your stronghold does not mean they are going to vote there is a plan that i'm going to review to upnd this election has already been done 
and the UPN has won the election. I'm going to tell them how to protect their vote. If Eddie Galungu does not leave power this coming August, they know that I'm, 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 I'm stupid. I said it. If Eddie Galungu wins this election, I will drop the microphone. I will stop being a prophet. I know everything I've told you from A to Z. And I told you that they are going to convict Tishimba Kambuli. If Tishimba Kambuli is a wise man, he will have nothing to do with PF. My father gave birth to me and said, your name is Ezia, I meaning good name. It's better to have good name than to have money. If you have money, you don't have good name, you are a fool. If you have money, if you have power, look at GBM. GBM is now a fool. He has money, he has everything, but he's a fool. He doesn't have name. He's now a chala boy for Edgar Lungu. Edgar was a baby boy. Edgar was nothing when GBM was a deputy, a, 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 a defense minister. Today, GBM has been reduced from a minister to a campaign manager. And he's, he's, he's running up and down like chicken campaigning for Edgar Lungu. For what reason? Who is Edgar Lungu? What is Eddie Galungu? I'm asking you this question. Answer me this question. I don't want you to, to come to people of Zambia and pretend like uh, uh, I don't, HH is doing this, uh, UPN is doing this, uh, it's my secretary general is doing this, uh, this and that. No, I want you to answer these questions before you, you start putting blames. When I finish talking to you, I will come to HH. Why are you not arrested for keeping over $160,000 in your house. If you are not in good books with PF, PF can arrest an opposition leader for coughing. <coughs> you can be arrested. How much more when there is a crime? Why have they not arrested you? It means, it means, I'm not saying that it has happened. It means that somewhere, somehow, you have started eating with them. Because if you eat with them, you can commit any crime you want. You cannot be arrested. This is the question that I'm asking you, uh, Honorable Tishimba Kambu. Answer me this question. Why have you not been arrested? Why? Answer the people of Zambia this question. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Savage. All right, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.